Good morning, everyone. I'm so glad you're here once again to learn more about our Heavenly Father. And today's Father's Day, and I'm going to ask you a question about uh, what sometimes fathers like to do with their family. Have you ever, how many of you have been camping? I want you to talk with your parents or your family about when was the last time you went camping? I bet, I bet when you went camping, you stayed in a tent. Have you ever stayed in a tent? Now, when you go camping, you stay in a tent for a couple days, but what would it be like? Would you like to live in a tent for the rest of your life? You see, I went to I went camping one time and we had just gotten a brand new tent. And you know what happened? After camping two nights in that tent, the tent broke. So we had to take it back. So now we don't even have a tent right now, but it didn't last. It only lasted two nights. Hopefully a good tent will last a long time, but you know what's the problem about living in a tent for the rest of your life is? Your tent's not going to last. And it really doesn't do that great of a job of protecting you. There's still that hard floor right underneath the tent. If a storm comes up, you might get water inside the tent. The tents don't last. And they don't do a very good job at providing. So it's fun to be in a tent for maybe a couple nights, maybe even a whole week. But I would think that you probably wouldn't want to live in a tent for the rest of your life. Because it doesn't last. Today in our reading, today in our, in, our, in our sermon, we're going to talk about how God compares our lives on earth to a tent. They're not going to last. And so if you're facing all sorts of trouble in this life, it won't last forever, which is good news because God is preparing us something so much better in heaven. You see, our lives, they're just temporary. They won't last forever. And so God wants us to focus on the fact that he is preparing for us a house, a building that lasts forever. He's going to provide us something special that lasts, that will protect us, that will keep us by his side forever. That's what he's going to do in heaven. Our earthly lives are like a tent, but our eternal life that is waiting for us is our heavenly home. It's our permanent house forever. So the question is, how do we get there? I know you know the answer. It's through God's son, Jesus. He died on the cross for us. He paid the price for all of our sins, and then he rose again. And so we will rise too, because we believe in Jesus as our Savior. So while we live here, let's always remember that this is not our permanent home. No, this is like that one week of camping. It might be uncomfortable, but it won't last forever. That's what happens in heaven where we get to live forever in our heavenly home. Let's thank God for preparing us for this heavenly home, this eternal house in heaven. You can repeat after me. Dear God, thank you for providing for us forever by giving us an eternal house. Amen. Thank you all so much for watching or for listening to this message. I'm, I'm so glad that you're here once again, and, and I can't wait to see you again next week. Bye.